now we have inserted into income now we are going to start at the main part of the of the adding a adding a user to system now mm, this is the main part part to add to join a user if if you will do any mistake here then the site will not work okay now we will do here what we will update count and income so <coughs> we need update count and income what is count now we need to create a we need to update our structure uh, where in the tree go and update update its structure by adding two columns and uh, first one is left count and second one is right count right count okay now it's uh, left count and right count and this column will store how my uh, how many user in the left side of this user and this column store how many user to the right side of this user of this okay of this user so and we need to also update our user table uh, here we need to update update its structure go here by adding one column and it is uh, it's uh, under user id it's very important i okay is user id under user id worker 50 now go here now this user have not any under user id but this user id has a under user id you can check it from here this user id yeah this user id is uh, under user id of this user id so we need to copy this uh, user id to here okay now you can see here this user id ha has not any under user id but this user id has under user id and want and we need to also insert here so go to upper side where insert into user insert into the profile okay is there you need to also insert here that is under user id under user id and go here and by which name we have saved under user id okay now under user id okay now it will be stored also under user now its main part here update count and income uh we need to assign a variable temp under user id i will show i, I will show you hmm, i will be assigning hmm, his uh, variable here now go to one tab under user id and store here under user id okay and also a temp place temp side you can say temp side and uh, this will be side count and now now it will be now you now suppose user has clicked here left then it will be equal to left count if user clicked here now it will be now it will be equal to right count and uh, it is equal to the structure here left count and uh, right count it will be depend on user so we take a value as side okay side count it means it will be either hmm, right count or left count you can you can write here left count or right count mm, okay now now what now we need to update the value okay now it's done for now now we need to update when 
a user will add it to here we need to update its uh, left count or um, right count if this user added to here then we will update left count or if this user is added to here then we will update its uh, um, right count okay now go ahead 